Hello, many thanks for joining me. Not a review today, uh, as you can probably guess by the title. I've been up today to the Bristol Beer Factory in Bristol, um, and uh, I've got some beer mats. Um, I was working, so I couldn't really go for a brewery tour or anything. Um, but um, it was nice to go in there, a little chat with the head brewer, and um, I've uh, managed to uh, bring some beers in with me, which is always a always a bonus. I'll show you them quickly. Um, I will be reviewing these. Um, obviously, some of these I have reviewed already, already because I got them from um, Fred at West Country Ales, um, Southfield Hop. You probably know, well, if you've seen my review of that, um, it blew my, blew me away. That lid says on. Um, <clears throat> it's a wheat beer, I believe. This one. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of sort of Belgian beers, but um, <clears throat> I'm going to give it a try because they are a really good brewery exhibition. I, I think I've had, I think I've had this one. I'm not entirely sure. Um, I want to go to a few other breweries, Arbor being one of them, but um, I didn't, um, I didn't have the chance to uh, to get in there, unfortunately. So, but I've got to go back there tomorrow, so I may have a chance to go there tomorrow. And the old milk stout, and I have reviewed that, and that was a belter, that brilliant beer, love that. Um, yeah, the first one, sorry, was the Independence. Um, but they, they all seem lovely, lovely beers. Um, cannot wait to get into those. Um, you can't see it very well. I'll move the camera down a bit and then you can see the range there. Fantastic, yeah. So thanks to the Bristol Beer Factory um, and I'm gonna enjoy drinking these and reviewing them. Cheers. <laughs> 